Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Check this out, we got a new game on our hands and I just want to say, I got it yesterday, I didn't get it earlier or anything. And I didn't have the highest hopes for this game, but my god, it's good. If you have any doubts getting this, uh, the only issue I have right now is the PC performance, which I get some frame drops from time to time, but it's not too bad. But yeah, I can totally recommend this game, it's awesome. The biggest gripe I have is that the katana has no counter. Which is why I'm using this weird umbrella thing. <laughs> uh, which, to my knowledge, is the only weapon that actually has a parry. And, um, dude, I actually, I love how this thing plays. Like, I still try to figure things out, but, um, yeah, it's awesome. So today I'm gonna take you on the first hunt which this game has to offer, which is a big fat rat. And I'm using the standard umbrella. Um, I already have unlocked some upgrades, but I'm pretty sure this is what you're supposed to have at this point. And, yeah, let's jump into the fight. I hope you enjoy. All right, there it is, enjoying itself. Um, one thing I want to mention is like the design on on the monsters is like actually really, really good. Like it's not just a red. Like look at all the detail it has on it. And uh, so yeah, like I said, I'm still trying to figure this weapon out. Uh, you have this, you have this bar above the above the health bar, which works kind of similar to the spirit gauge from uh, Monster Hunter and Longsword. And the best way to fill it up is uh, with these parries. And once it's filled up, like your your basic attacks will will hit multiple times, and also you get a different move set. But uh, I will say, like the the timing on these parries is not easy. Like if you want to compare it to Monster Hunter Rise, I guess the switch skill swap if you have uh, redirection on your build. I think it's pretty similar to that. Like. I would, I would guess like 0 0.01 seconds, does that make sense? And here we go again, so if I would have to describe this weapon in Monster Hunter terms, I would say like it's a mixture between um, the Insect Glaive and Longsword, because you also have access to these aerial attacks, and as long as you have stamina, you can, you can stay in the air forever, you can also parry mid-air, which um, is definitely not that easy, and I haven't played around with that too much. So yeah, uh, just trying to stay on the ground for now and get the hang of this weapon. But, um, like, I can say right now, you have so many... Like, it just feels amazing. I feel like if you truly master this weapon, you can you have so many options. And right now I'm having a blast with this weapon. I was sad at first that I wasn't able to use the katana. But my god, I love this playstyle with this, uh, with this thing. It's a nice parry, and yeah, after a successful parry, you get access to this nice counter move, which is pretty powerful. I uh, gotta watch out here. Nice parry, gonna fly in his face. Awesome parry that. And now it's time to unleash the big attack. I missed. <laughs> Crap. But yeah, I'm pretty sure like that is the uh, biggest damage opportunity, at least that I've found right now. Ah, uh, that's terrible timing. And yeah, like I said, the <laughs> timing on the parry is definitely not easy. Let's have another one. Now. Nice, let's go. Uh, let's try to unleash that. Oh yeah, nice, we got the topple. So, in order to gain access to this attack right here, you your bar has to be full, it has to be red. You need to parry and then you just bam X. And yeah, it deals some good damage. Oh, he's leaving again. Let's chase him. Here we go again. And um, I have to say, the I feel like the monsters are leaving too early. I think it's not uh, dependent on how much time has passed, but how much damage he dealt. Which uh, sucks for speedrunning. I'm curious to see how speedruns for this game are going to turn out. Because, yeah, I think the monsters are just going to leave if you deal too much damage. And uh, that's it. Let's finish him off. Nice. Yeah, uh, I really like this red fun hunt and all of the other hunts I had so far. Also amazing. I love this game. If you aren't up, if you should get it, I can definitely recommend. But if you're getting PC, wait until they fix the issues. And uh, yeah, definitely going to make more content on this game. Having a blast. I hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.